How to create a blog in Google Sites. Hey guys, welcome back. In this video, I'll show you guys step by step how you can build a blog in Google Sites. So let's get into it. Now, the first thing you have to do is head on over to sites.google.com and make sure you're logged into your Google account that you want to use to get started with building your blog. Once you do that, simply click on the blank template over here and we're going to get started from scratch. Now, once you click on your blank template, this is going to be your main page. On the top left, you might want to enter a logo or your site's name. Let's say for us, this is going to be Paris Travel Diaries. Now, once you've entered the name of your particular site, you can add that or add your logo simply by clicking on add logo and upload your logo if you have one. Even if you don't, it's all right. After that, you're going to start building your home page. Now, in your home page, you can click on the header. And then on the bottom left, you have multiple different choices of headers. You have a large banner, a cover header, a title only. So let's say I want to do a cover header. After that, I will enter my page title, which might be Paris Adventures. After that, I might want to customize this text. So to do that, I can simply click on the text box and you will see the different types of text that are available. There's title, there's heading, subheading, small text, and then you have multiple different fonts available and you can choose the font that you like. So let's say I want this medium bold font like this one and I can select my text, go into this font like this and I can add my particular text over here. Now, after you've entered your text, you might want to align it properly. So making sure everything is aligned properly. And I want all of this to be centered, so I'm just going to select my text and click on the alignment and make sure this box is centered. Now I'm going to add some spaces over here like this and remove some from the bottom section like so. Now after I have done this, I can add an image to the background. So to add an image, click on image on the bottom left and click on upload or select. I'm going to click on upload and you can get royalty free stock footage from pixels.com as well. So I'm just going to search for a royalty free image of Paris and I will just add this image over here. Click on save image as and then you can download your photo and upload it over here. So I'm just going to upload my image from here. Click on downloads and now our image has been added. Now after I've added this, I want to start building my blog. So below this, I'm going to add my next section. Your section should be categorized for people to be able to easily access your blogs. So you want to categorize your blogs. Now, the way that I'm going to do this is I'm going to use these content blocks on the right side and I'm going to click on this one. So three of my blogs would be featured over here. And I'm also going to add a text box on top. I'm going to click on text box. Now I can move this text box up simply by clicking on these left dots and I'm going to move it up here, Just moving it above the section. Now I'm going to enter featured blogs. Now I'm going to change the style of this to a heading text or to a title text as well as the font like so. And then I'm also going to change the color of our text. Now you can also change the color of each individual section so you guys can see there are multiple different styles available. Now over here I can start uploading my blogs. Each blog would be correspondent to an individual page on your Google site. So to do that, let's enter a title. So for example, I'm going to create a blog called Best Food Hots in Paris. So let's say this is going to be the title of my blog so I'm going to enter it over here. I'm also changing the color of the text and then below that I can add a basic description of the text. So I'm just going to add some sample text. So just to show you guys how the text would be formatted, I'm just going to paste this sample text over here. And after that, I can also customize the text. Let's say this is a bit too long. I'm going to make it slightly short. So let's say this is a bit too long. I'm just going to make this slide shorter and you can just enter like a basic highlight of your blog. After that, you're going to add your image to your blog as well. For that, I'm going to use pixels again. And let's say I'm going to add food, Paris food. And then I'm just going to take this image over here and download this. And then I can go into our blog and click on upload. And we're going to upload our image over here. Now, after you've added your image and the title of your blog, 
what you're going to do is that you're going to click on your title and then you're going to click on this chain icon over here. Once you do that, you can enter a link to where your page will lead to. So you're going to do the same thing with your image as well. But before that, you're going to click on pages on the top right of your screen. Click on the plus icon and build a new page. This is going to be named the particular blog title, Best Food Huts in Paris. Now, one thing I want to do is I don't want to show it in our top navigation. So I'm going to click on hide from navigation. And then below that, what I'm going to do is that I'm going to go back into our home page. And then on our home page, I'm going to click on the heading and link this to the particular page and then click on apply. Now you can choose to remove the underlying formatting as well. You don't need to keep this and you can choose to go back to your default colors as well. Now, whenever someone clicks on this, the new page for the best food huts in Paris would open up and the image over here is non-collapsible. So I'm going to keep it as it is. Now, if you take a look at this image, just do a double click on the image and you're going to follow the same steps. Simply click on this chain icon and link this page into this item as well. Now I'm going to click on the right side and onto the page. And this is what the blog page is, but you're going to change this. So you're going to set your header to title only, and you're going to enter your title like this. However, you want to structure your blog and then click on insert. And then you can start inserting your blog over here. Let's say this is our blog and you can enter the rest of your blog as well. Now let's go back into our home page and you're going to follow these steps for the rest of your sections as well. So you're going to do pretty much the same thing on these other two sections. Now, after that, you might want to add a categorization of your blogs. To do this, you can go into your pages and you will be able to see your basic properties in your pages. This is called our home page or you can make it your blog page. But after that, you want to click on the plus icon. And then what you're going to do is you're going to create a page called blogs. Now in your blogs page, you can make this a large banner or just a banner. And then below that, what you're going to do is you can add a section of all of your blogs. So I'm going to click on text box and I'm going to add all blogs over here. And then after that, you can display all of your blogs in the form of text or in the form of an image and some a little bit of text like this. And you can add all of your blogs over here. And you're going to do it the same way that you did it on your home page. Now, once you've made your basic edits, you can go back and click on publish on the top right. And you can choose the domain that you want to use. After that, you're going to click on publish over here. And just like that, your Google Sites blog will now be published. Now let's take a look at our published blog. So let's go on ahead and go back to our Google Sites account. And now our Paris travel diaries have been posted or published. I'm going to click on open new tab. So we want to view this not as a moderator, but as a guest. So what I'm going to do is I'm just going to take a look and then after our publishing, we are going to click on visit published site. Now this is what our blog currently looks like. It looks really nice. We have our featured blogs and then we have our blog section where all of our blogs would be present. And then if I click on the image over here, this leads me to our actual blog. If I do the same thing with the title of this blog, this is going to lead me back to our blog. So I hope you guys found this video helpful. If you did, make sure to leave a like and subscribe and I will catch you guys in the next video.